morning. Hi, Simply Subbies. Welcome back. It's the day of my life vlog. It's actually, I really don't have a whole lot planned, but I'm headed to the gym. It is J15, January the 15th, 2022, the 114th um, Founders Day for Alpha Kappa Alpha Sorority Incorporated. My sorors, and I'm headed to the gym. I really don't have much planned, but I feel like I would just show you guys a little bit. Of course, I have on my paraphernalia, and I'll be picking green all day. But headed to the gym, so see you guys in a bit. Okay guys, I am back home from the gym. I had taken down my Christmas tree earlier, actually last week, maybe a month, well earlier this week, Monday, cause today is Saturday. And so I just got that stuff out of here. I do need to vacuum where the tree was. I moved my furniture back. See, there's no tree. For those of you who have been following me for vlogmas, there was a tree right there. I have set my fireplace and I am getting ready to watch um, Ready to Love. It is the reunion show and I'm so excited because the season is over. I have been reviewing it from the very first episode this season and seasons past. So you guys definitely check it out because it will be uh, uploaded this week. Okay, actually, it may come out before this one comes out because this is a day in my life and I already am dropping a video today, which is my vision board. So you guys probably have already seen that. You, the Ready to Love um, reunion will also be up. So you probably could go see that. So definitely go check that out. It probably was uploaded last week. So if you have not yet seen it, let's see what's, what it's like. If the couples are still together, let's chat about it in the comments. Y'all let me know what y'all think. Go back to that video and check it out. Um, and then I saw, I thought they were doing Miami next, but it looks like they're actually doing another DC, but more Potomac, DMV area, but Potomac, uh, Maryland. So... I've seen the cast. I need to see some clips of what's going on so we can see how we gonna feel about that. But I will definitely probably be reviewing it too. That is one of my favorite shows. Um, this season left a lot to be desired, but I'm hoping that they get it right next season. So I'll be back. You guys come back and stay tuned. My reality recaps. That may be the only show I actually um, commit to to recapping on a weekly basis and I, I still think I may do some kind of a reality roundup like weekly because I watched Married at First Sight and Love is Blind season two comes out I may have to review that um I usually watch Too Hot to Handle from time to time um you know Love Island I love Love Island I love 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 Island and I started watching it back when it came on Hulu from the UK. So before they had Love Island US, but I've watched two of the three seasons, the six, second and the third season of Love Island US, and I like those as well. So if they have a Love Island US season four, I'll probably be reviewing that as well. The fact that I watch Love Island UK after, like they don't put it on Hulu like the next day. It's like in the future, and it's already been filmed. So because of that, I don't want to film that because it will be old news by the time I actually get to record it. But the US, I can do. So I am looking forward to doing that. Come back, come back. If you're hopeless romantic or you love these little dating shows or whatever, not, what not, reality shows. But yeah, so what I'm going to do now is, oh, I did want to show you guys a couple of things. So... Y'all, I got my popcorn. I went to the movie yesterday and 
I had popcorn left over, so I came home and put in some Tupperware, of course, so I can get ready for my show. But I did want to do a quick unboxing and a quick um, show you what I got. Show me what you got, little mama. Is that how I go? I don't even know the beat, but y'all know what I'm talking about. Um, so I went to Tuesday morning yesterday. Um, I did vlog that too. I vlogged yesterday, so you may possibly see it either on my Instagram channel in a mini vlog. Um, day in my life. So if you guys are not yet following me on my social media, Instagram, I am Stacy with an I underscore, I'm sorry, I am simply with an I underscore Stacy. It'll be on the screen somewhere at some point. And then on Facebook, I am simply Stacy, both with eyes. That is my business page. But yeah, definitely on Instagram, I post at least three times a day motivational stuff. Um, Simply Stacy branding stuff and just like, you know, some really cool stuff. Check out the link in my bio so that you, I'm sorry, the link in the description box so that you can see all the things I have. We have a Simply Savings Challenge. Guys, it's probably about week two or three, three or four at this point when you guys will see this video, meaning you should have already made either four deposits, one per week of $197. Or if you get paid bi-weekly like I do, you should have already made one, maybe two payments of $3.94. And so, yes, go ahead and download that guide. It is a free guide. You can find it at that link. You can see any other freebies I have, like a 12-month goal setting. We're in January, so definitely get your goals down on paper. Write them out. Write the vision. Make it plain. Um, yeah, and then I also have a vision board video that you probably could have seen that was posted last week as well so definitely check that out if you have not yet done your vision board you still have time it is end of january maybe early february so you still have time yes okay so i went to tuesday morning yesterday and i just got some cool little things um i got some stuff for christmas gifts this is from nordstrom rack i won't show you guys what those are but yeah this is the perfect time and i told my mom this year i'm gonna do what she does which is shop for christmas all year long so when you run into something that is a good price that is something nice that you think somebody on your list because typically our lists don't change that that much throughout the year um you can just pick it up and then mark them off and when it's christmas time you won't be spending all of your money at once but when you have things you can get affordable things and they'll really really like them so those two things are christmas gifts for 2022 um so i started mom Okay, and then I have been wanting some hot chocolate, but I'm not really a chocolate drinker. I know, guys. So I was like, I need some white chocolate or something of this sort, but I've been seeing these like um, hot chocolate bombs. It looks so good and just looks like something I want, right? But I did go to uh, Tuesday morning and they had a whole wall of different kinds of hot chocolate mix. And this is a creamy butterscotch cocoa mix. So I was like, ooh, butterscotch. I was thinking like coffee, I mean toffee, butterscotch or caramel would be good. So this is like a hot chocolate tin. I cannot wait to try it. I'm gonna probably show you guys. So go to my Instagram, you guys will see. So I got a tin of that. Um, it is by McStevens Gourmet Cocoa. And it's a cocoa mix. It says it's naturally flavored. Um, serving size is two and a half tablespoons and it's about 140 calories per serving um you place two to three tablespoons of cocoa mix in six to eight ounces of hot water you stare and then you enjoy but that's not even the end of it so i actually got these now these are so cool they were also at tuesday morning these are cocoa toppers so it is by bone v bone Bon, sorry, Bon v Viet, and it's handmade in the U.S. It's cocoa toppers, marshmallows, and salted caramel. So you can see, you just put this on top of your cup of hot cocoa. So I was like, ooh, this is gonna be so delicious with my little bug curled in by the fireplace, like with my blanket on and my fluffy socks. Those who know me know I'm always cold and love a nice cozy day, honey. So yeah, I got a couple of those for my big tin. And then I also got this tin. I love green tea. If you guys have ever followed me for a while, I've mentioned green tea many of times. So 
this was $7.99. Those uh, cocoa toppers were $4.99. And then the actual cocoa um, tin was $7.99. So, yeah. But this is so nice. And this could also be Christmas gifts. But I got it for myself because I really wanted some tea. But I may go back there in the future and get some if I'm buying more Christmas gifts. But it's a green tea collection. They had green tea. They had regular tea. They had... Um, exotic tea they had all kinds of different tins but I am a green tea girl so I got this one and it comes with mango peach mango tea elevated green tea pomegranate Moroccan tea nope sorry pomegranate Moroccan mint tea tropical tea and then jasmine tea and they're all green tea 72 bags of it I cannot wait to try it out you guys know I typically drink a cup of tea a day um, every morning especially on work days so I'm super excited about it so that is my little haul from Tuesday morning and then I am going to show you what came in the mail for me because I put in a purchase um, with a company a black owned company you know uh, February is right around the corner if it is not yet black history month so support your small businesses support your black businesses and support your women owned business the business I'm going to be talking about is all three days but I just went and got it at the mailbox yesterday so I am opening it up and I'm going to do a quick little um, unboxing for you guys so I actually don't have many plans today. I actually plan to just chill. I, like I said, I went to the gym. You guys saw that earlier today. And I put away my Christmas stuff. I am going to film content and work on my blog. If you guys have not yet checked it out, check out the Simply Stacy blog. It is at stacyhuddleston.com um, forward slash blog, actually. But even if you go to simplystacy.com, you can navigate to the blog. But if you just uh, forward slash blog, then you'll see all of my content that I have on there as well. So I will be updating some content on my blog as well. But all of that is in the description box. So definitely check that out. And here we go. I'm so excited. So I got two of the large, large ones. So in the winter time, y'all, I need all the moisturizers I can get. And what I have become so um, enamored by, or I'm just so into these days, is the Wits Shea Butter. Especially those that are fragrance, um, have really good fragrances. Because Shea Butter to me does not smell good. I'm just going to be honest with y'all. I do not like, you know you've seen the big the big um scoops of the yellow color uh shea butter and it just has i mean there's a distinct shea butter smell but i don't love it so this is my cousin's brand it is called melanate i think they're melanate life on facebook and instagram at melanate life and like again the eight so it's m-e-l-a-n and then the number eight and this is their whipped shea butter. You can email melanatelife at gmail.com, Facebook and Instagram at melanatelife. And then this is actually true beauty. This is my very favorite. Guys, it smells oh, divine. Like you want something light, airy. I think if you were like ordering this for yourself or someone else and you like nice subtle scents that are clean and refreshing true beauty is definitely my all-time favorite my cousin knows every time i order i'll be getting the same same scent so last time she actually um gave me a sample of another scent that she thought i may like and i actually did like it so i ordered another jar so this one um there again you can see actually see the label with all of the information and it's again a whipped body butter whip this is a whip maybe they're both different i'm not sure but this is a whipped shea butter and this one says it's a whipped body butter either way i love them both the consistency is amazing it's very very moisturizing and this one smells really good so this one has more of a little it has a little tinge of tropical to me um, and this is the scent sweet sugar, um, but I like it as well. But like I said, if you're going to, I'm just gonna put a little bit on my hand so you guys can just 
see how it just melts into your skin and how moisturizing look at that guys oh yeah smooth smooth honey is a baby's bottom but at least that's what i heard but anyway so moisturizing so good and for people like me with like extremely dry skin and eczema um it's definitely a game changer so if you guys have not checked them out before i know i've done last february for sure we did a spotlight and i did an unboxing then too black businesses women-owned business like listen check them out melanate um life i believe on facebook and instagram so definitely check it out i'm so excited i was at the very bottom of my true beauty so i definitely was in need of that and then like i said i only had a sample of the sweet sugar so i needed that too Yes, so I traveled home during the holiday with my shea butter and I needed more. So I'm so excited. She wasn't home because she is from my hometown. Um, I mean, St. Louis, Illinois. And so when I went home, she wasn't there. And she's, listen, she's like, I'll just ship it to you. And I'm like, oh, perfect. So she takes, you know, all the forms of Zelle and PayPal or, I mean, let me not say PayPal, but the electronic payments she does and she ships so if you need her reach out to her she has all kinds of fragrances and all kinds of scents i've smelled at least three different ones i liked all of them but for me personally true beauty is my favorite 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 um yeah definitely check her out and yes thanks cousin thank you so much for sending my order i will be ordering more you know how i do okay guys like i said i don't have very very much plans if i do do anything else i'll definitely be sure to add it to this video but for now i'm probably going to make me a cup of tea eat my popcorn watch my ready to love and yeah it's a chill out day but it is j15 it is the 114th Founders Day for Alpha Kappa Alpha Sorority Incorporated. So you guys see I am paraphernalia up. This is probably like actually the third video I've shot in this today because you know I'm batching content. But either way, I still gotta give it up to my sorors. Happy Founders Day. And yes, I'm going to be chilled out. Oh, I do have some stuff, but I have like virtual um founders day celebration with my sorors and stuff like that so it's nothing that i have to leave the house for but really nothing to vlog about either i may insert some clips we'll see how that goes on my zoom calls today but yeah that's basically basically it i am going to be recording and you know i have to do my recap so i have my simply living is about love trust and mimosas for brunch this is the simply stacy merch oops it's one of my hardcover journals and i absolutely love it like i'm just gonna be honest with y'all but i want y'all to see and see i take my notes and then i film later but it just has ruled pages and you guys can get these for less than 15 dollars. i think it's 14.90 or something like that but check it out stacyhuddleston.com forward slash shop for all of your like inspirational motivational simply stace merch we have it hardcover journals candles joggers um sweatshirts t-shirts and i have some really cool things coming for you guys for valentine's day and black history month you guys know i launched um the simply love line and then the black history collection last february so some of those favorites will be back like your simply black your black girl magic um black boy joy black since the 1980s or the 70s since whatever since whenever you were born um and stuff like that and of course i have a couple new pieces that will be coming out in the 2022 launch of black history month and uh valentine's day is around the corner so if you're looking for gifts for your loved ones definitely hit up the simply stacy store and check out the simply stacy merch okay guys like comment subscribe share my videos <laughs> share with anybody share the knowledge share the wealth share the laughs share the you know whatever and until next time see ya